Hey there, Trisha with Doodlebug Craft Finds, and today I wanted to give you the opportunity to hear what some of our squeaker uh, parts sound like, and these are squeakers that you could use to make dog toys with, or even baby toys if that's um, what your craft is. So we have a couple different kinds. These ones here are more um, flat, so we call them the flat squeaker. So there are two sizes, and you can see in my hand for reference. They both pretty much make the same noise. So here's the small one. And the, the bigger of the uh, flat ones, they're pretty much the same. And then over here, these two here are larger, but they are also puncture proof. So if your dog chews through the toy and puts a hole in it, it will still squeak. And I'll uh, demonstrate that in a minute. But um, the smaller of those, the one that looks like a little grenade, kind of sounds like these other little ones. And then the larger one, the one that looks like a little shampoo bottle, has a way cooler squeak. But I just wanted to show you, I have one of these um, bottle ones that I put, I don't know if you can see it, but I put holes all around it um, as if a dog had punctured it. And you can see it's not as robust, but the, the noise does still um, happen when there's, when there's holes in it. So that's these two here are the puncture proof ones. I'll go ahead and leave links down in the description for these uh, different parts, but I'll also leave another uh, link to a video that I did showing you how to make a little squeaker toy for your puppy out of an old pair of jeans. So I'll leave that down below as well. Thanks for joining us today.